Please don't hack my account. Hello, Jack. <laughs> don't hack my account. I'm Jester. So, um, what I want to do is do a quest series called um, Heroes Quest. Or do specific specifically do a quest called Heroes Quest. Um, it's something that I've got to unlock some stuff to do first. Or I've got some unlocking to do first. Uh, but yeah, uh, it's something that uh, makes a few other things a bit easier to do. Like, uh, there's a certain like mineral that I can get from the mine and stuff like that. So, I need to get all this shit done. So, Lost City and Merlin's Crystal. I think Lost City was one I can complete. I don't know about Merlin's Crystal. Maybe I can't do Merlin's Crystal till I've done Lost City. So, let's do Lost City. Which one's that? I need to defeat a level 63 tree spirit. So powerful. No required items. Perfect. Lumbridge Swamp. Beautiful. So yeah, this is the first time we're playing uh, RuneScape where I'm actually doing like a quest. Rather than just running through um, archaeology for like four hours. So it's going to be nice. Bit different. Not the same shit as always. I've been playing a lot of this though. Merlin's Crystal. More like Murdo's Crisp Bill. You sure? You sure got him? That's how cool my cl uh, character's looking now, by the way. It's okay to be jealous, peasants. I'm very powerful looking. So, we need to go talk to the warrior in Lumbridge Swamp. Oh, it's Lumbridge. It's ever so lovely there. Dude, that man's hair is, like, glorious. Also, I got my archaeology pet as well. He's called Archie. He's probably very cute. There's a quest symbol there, so let's try there. Sounds like a plan. But yeah, I've not been playing too much RuneScape uh, since the weekend. Sunday was like the last time I went mad on it, but... Cyberina, thank you for getting the reference. I can kiss away the pain. Hello, Cyberina, how are you? Hope you're well. <laughs> I just dab with one arm, bottle flipped with the other, and fidget spinned with the other. Am I cool? Uh, not unless you're playing uh, RuneScape at the same time. I can kiss away the pain. I will stand by you forever. You can take my breath away. I should probably read some of this shit, shouldn't I? Who's Xanaris? They're looking for Xanaris. Ah ha ha ha. Xanaris isn't a person. It's a magical hidden city filled with treasures and rich. Oh, uh, nothing. It's nothing. If it's hidden, how are you planning to find it? Idiot. Well, we don't want to tell anyone about that because we don't want anyone else sharing in all that glory and treasure. Please tell me. <laughs> Sir, please. No. Oh. Please? No. Please. No. Why won't he tell me? Why are all of you standing around here? None of your business get lost. Okay, beautiful. Talk to the wizard. Why are all of you standing around here? Ha ha ha, you dare talk to a mighty wizard such as myself? I bet you can't even cast airstrike yet, amateur. I can. You're an idiot. <laughs> My character does not give a shit. Why are you guys hanging around here? Um, guys? Yo, it's 2020. Respect the feminist regime. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Why are all of you standing out here? That's really not your business. Oh. So the wizard is the guy to talk to to get this quest going, I think. Hello there, traveler. Do you know, on, yeah, do you know any good adventures I can go on? Well, we're on an adventure right now. Mind you, this is our adventure. We don't want to share it. Find your own. I don't think you find a good adventure at all. That's it. We make him sound stupid. Ha. Adventurers of, adventurers of our caliber don't just hang around in forests of fun. Welp. Rude. Oh, really? Why are you camped out here? We're looking for Xanaris. Yeah, I mean, we're not here for any particular reason at all. What makes you think it's out here? Don't you know of the legends that tell of the magical city hidden in the swamp? Um, no, you're right. We're wasting our time here. There's no such thing. Ah, the old reverse psychology. That's what I'm going with. I think it'll work. There's no such thing. When we found Xanaris, you'll... Yeah, I mean, we're not here for any particular reason at all. Uh, I don't know what to click on to... What's Xanaris? I don't think we want other people competing with us to find it. Forget I said anything. Oh, well, never mind. Hmm. Okay. I'm confused. Talk to the warrior adventurer in Lumbridge Swamp. So somewhere, there's a way to trigger this guy into giving me this quest. 
I'm, I will figure it out because I am a smart person. I qualified uh, top of my class in intelligence and cunning and being a cu I mean being clever I've got to I've got to there's got to be a way to trick him into it so the please tell me no please tell me no is like a definite dead end isn't it yeah it's definitely a dead end okay this is so annoying just fucking ah <laughs> Give me the quest, idiot. Okay, we'll try reverse psychology again. We'll see if that works. So they're looking for Xanaris. What makes you think it's out here? Maybe we've got to go find it, but I feel like we haven't started the quest yet. Hang on. It looks like you don't know either. Okay. Well, it looks like you don't know either, seeing as you're all sat out here. Of course we know. We just haven't found which tree the stupid leprechaun's hiding in yet. We've tricked him, idiot. There's a leprechaun in a tree. Thanks for the help. Okay. Help? What help? I didn't say... What? I didn't help. Okay, so we've got to find a tree that a leprechaun might be in. Now, chat, if you were a leprechaun, what kind of tree would you hi be hiding in? Just gonna start swinging and hoping for the best. The little critter starts yelling at me for chopping down his home. We've got it! Hey, you big elephant. Sorry, let me, chat, do you want the Irish accent? A little upset, everybody. I think we want the Irish. Hey, you big elephant. You've called me. What would an elephant like you be wanting? Oh, Shamison. I want to find Xanaris. Xanaris is it now? Well, well, well. If you've been in that funny little shed out there in the swamp, so you will. Shed? I thought Xanaris was a city. Aye, then it is. How does it fit in a shed, then? Ah, you stupid elephant. The city isn't in the shed. The doorway to the shed is the portal to Xanaris, so it is. So I just walk into the shed and end up in Xanaris? Oh, was I was I forgetting to say? You need to be carrying a dream and stuff to be getting in there. Otherwise, you'll be ending in the shed. Where can I get such a staff? Three demon staves are crafted from branches of the Dreaming Tree. So they are. I hear there's a Dreaming Tree in a cave up on the island of Entra Entrana. Entrana? Entrana. It'd probably be a good place to look for an elephant like you to look, I reckon. The monks are running a ship from Port Sarum to Entra. So I hear. Do you need to teleport over to Port Sarum? Yes, please. A teleport would be wonderful. Useful. Right, you are. Hold on. Now, uh, chat, please raise your hand if you find the Irish accent offensive. Because it wasn't my best impression. My mouth's a bit bleh today. Oh, yes, my mouth's a bit bleh. That was very good. Thanks. I feel like we need uh, a friend. My word, you're a walking armory. There is no way that I'm allowing you to set foot on Entrana until you remove them. Them? You monks are all wimps. Oh, well, can you at least tell me what items you have issues with? The following items are not <laughs> allowed on Entrana. Any of my gear. Literally none of my gear is allowed on there. Okay, well. If I get bummed and I can't defend myself, I'm not going to be happy. Swear to God. Do not bum me. I am but a dilapidated boat. Yo, the good ship suggester. I wish I got a better screenshot. God damn it. People still say bummed. What? Yeah? Why would people still not say bummed? Oh, it's very pleasant here. Oh, yes. Rather. Did you want something more graphic or... I found a dreaming tree in a cave somewhere in Ontrano. If I was a cave... Dungeon link to Tavoli. Does anything here look like a cave to you, chat? Sand pit. I get the feeling it's that one up there. Top left. Thank you, Shiv. Also, hi, buddy. How are you? I like how the map is still old school style. Yeah. 
It's very cool, isn't it? <laughs> oh my god, I've just seen my arms. I've got I'm covered in cat claws. That little bastard started jumping directly on my bare arm now with claws. It's not nice. I didn't think people still say uh, didn't think people say that still. I know exactly what I could say to be way more graphic, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to say bummed because it's funny. Be careful going in there. You are unarmed, and this is a, there is much evilness lurking down there. The evilness seems to be block seems to block off our contact with our gods. So our prayers seem to have less effect down there. Oh, also you won't be able to come back this way. This ladder only goes one way. The only exit from the caves below is a portal which is guarded by greater demons. God damn it! Poop and shit. I just want to chop down a tree. Is the tree in here? Sh the tree's over there. I see it. Be brave. I'm always brave. Have you met me? I'm the bravest of the brave. In your hair. I could punch these demons to death, but I don't want to. Please to leave me alone. Please, sirs and madams. It's okay. Line of sight is your best friend. What? Wait, stop, 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 never mind. Uh I have no gear. What the fuck do I do? I don't wanna die. Do I face it in fisticuffs? Punch, kick, it's all in the mind. Telly out if you can. Okay. Not today, Satan. <laughs> so I'm guessing a better way would be to, like, figure out how to get there with my weapons. I'm confoodled. Am I dumb? Do doodle do. Take unstrung bow and unfeathered arrows. <sighs> the dumb thing is, I remember this goddamn quest now. I've, I've definitely done all of this in like original RuneScape. So where's the bank from here? There's a, I know there is a bank. Do I know there's a bank? So I remember being like really stuck on this. There's a way to do melee, but I don't remember it. Yeah, they might not be able to do it anymore anyway because of uh, Thingy. Ooh, someone was a member in original RuneScape. It was me! Back when it was like £3.79 a month or some shit like that. Hello, Shiv. Just thought it's probably be an easy way to talk to you about it instead of mashing stop, stop, stop in chat and then hoping you see it. Yeah, I mean, I did tell you I'd be in <laughs> chat and, uh, you know, you enjoy me. I'm sad. Right, I know I've got string. I've definitely got wood. Wink. It's whether I've got everything else. Um, I'm just going to quickly... How is your range? Oh, it's uh, like 50 or 60. It's it's quite good. Okay. I don't know if I can make magic bows. I can definitely wield them. Yeah, oh, well, obviously I, take the best you can. I'm absolutely fine, actually. I've got unstrung stuff from, like, last time I did this shit. Cool. Uh... Headless or unfeathered arrows? Uh, you want them one step, or you could take all components. Basically, you just can't have anything that is a ready-made weapon. Okay, I've got loads of headless arrows. That's fine. Yeah, do that, and then take a load of heads. It's not funny, just I don't laugh. So what's my... Is it Mithril with Willow? Uh, Pass. Oh, I think you can go up to... like You could literally wield, like, poison... Dragon tipped arrows. They just won't do as but much they damage. Just would, yeah, they won't yep. do the maximum damage at all. Nope, that's fine. I can uh, I can work with that. How are you, buddy? Same, same. Good, good. Um, I was gonna say, tummy rumblies. Tummy rumblies. You hungry? 
No, no, like upset tummy, tummy run. Oh, buddy, what happened? I don't know. She's got like epic stomach ache, and it keeps like, you know, when when you get like epic, like stomach growls. Yes, I have them frequently because I forget to eat. <laughs> yeah, I keep getting them at the minute. Oh, okay. Have you considered not? I mean, I thought about it. Okay. But then, like, well, I have stomach ache, and okay. then when it does the growlies, it goes away for like five minutes. So I kind of like the growlies. It does the growlies. Okay, can you add a minute? That's fine. Uh, how's your day been so far? Uh. Yeah, so. Finished watching um the Star Wars marathon at four AM this morning. Very nice. Yep. Just I, under twenty four hours. I just realised I said I was going to watch uh, episode seven. I I've done a lot this a lot actually on Saturday. I'm probably not going to be awake enough to do it on Saturday. Yeah. Well, I mean, I fell asleep during the very last film and I had to rewatch it again. Ooh, you hate to see it. Yeah. I could have done that through uh, episode four, five, and six. I skipped six and skipped two thirds of five. Yep, I look because they're just awful. Like, I, I don't a, care what people say; they're awful. Films. There's, I think, there's a lot of truth in uh, this. Happens with a lot of video game stuff as well. Your first one is like your favorite. And Final Fantasy being a really good example of that. So trying to go back to watching those, if like episode one was your first one, because you probably really like episode one, two, three, but you. Then not going to enjoy four, five, six so much. The amount of people that hate on one, two, and three are all the people that grew up with four, five, and six. Yeah. So you're never going to win with like either group. I mean, how are you, are you? Are you watching them in order? Yeah. What order are you watching them in? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, chronological. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are you doing solo and all that lot as well? Um, I mean, it's a bit late to do it in chronological, so I think we're going to leave them to the last. But I'll look into it. I was going to say, uh, Loki Solo may be my favourite Star Wars film. Mm. Okay. The last uh, one is also really good, although it, apparently it's like really controversial, but I don't quite understand why. Yeah, I, I've, I've heard some shit, but I'm not, yeah. gonna, I'm not with those crowds. It was crowds. a cool film. <laughs> yeah. Friday watching you, Saturday watching you, Sunday early morning watching MITB Live, My Body Wants to Kill Me. Watching you? As in me? What do you mean you? No, you. No, me? Oh, no, I've you. got to take a screenshot again. God damn it. No, you. Oh, no, not me. No, you. No, you! God damn it, chat, stop. Why well, you got to be like this, chat? Chat, right, show of hands, right? In fact, no, not even show of hands. Tell me where you first experienced no, you. Where the phrase uh, no you, why did you start like making using that phrase? Because of you. Because of me? Yeah. I'm sorry. You're the first person I ever heard say it. Yikes, really? Yep. I'm so powerful. I'm so influential. Well, the only person I heard say it is since I've been over the age of like five. I've never heard anyone when I was five say no you. Well, it used to be like, you know, like when you were little and you'd be like No, you yeah, but like, you're so gay. Like, no, no you. you. Yeah, okay. I uh, I can I can see what you're saying with that one. Yeah, we've done it, boys. We're very powerful, very ready. Like when someone would be like you, poopy head. The best response would be no, you. But it literally was said with that inflection, wasn't it? It's like no, you. Oh, yep. No, you is like it's slightly different to that. Only of slightly. course, got credit during Eurovision. <laughs> I heard it from Eurovision server when I. Told a girl from Greece that gyros and kebab are the same. Aren't gyros a uh, money thing? No, they're gyroscopes. A gyroscope. Yeah, stabilization systems. Memes. Also now. So, as far as I'm aware, one of the main origins of No You was um, a show called RB and the Chief, which was. Um, a guy who had a master, fi uh, master chief and an arbiter figure and made them talk to each other all the time. Made them oh, fight each other. Way before that. It's like, that's the first time I saw No You, and that's where I know most people got No You from, as like used in images. I still don't know where anybody else got it from, and barely anybody knows about Arby and the Chief, which is weird. Never heard of it. 
And the other famous phrase from that is the ruffle cop to go swash, 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 which is always always makes me laugh as well. Mm, I know ruffle cop though. And I know meme. if you've heard me say uh, cocko duty modern gay shit, that is uh, also from RB and Chief, because obviously their a main enemy would be Call of Duty back in the day. Halo's main enemy. But Coco Duty came from uh, came from that show. And there we go. Cool day. That's uh, that's my story. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. And I chopped down a tree. I oh, just I forgot to tell you to bring food, but I apparently you are a high enough level to not need to worry about it. Shiv, let me tell you, I'm very powerful. Uh, also, grab another, grab yeah. another staff. Ooh, ooh, okay. Why do you think two are required? Uh, because you will lose one. Okay, uh, a bit presumptuous? No, it, tr trust me, everybody loses one. Okay. I right. have, I think, five. Right now, chat, remember, he's just said that. If I make it, then I've become the most powerful person in this game. No, no, it's in, like, through time. Oh, I get that, I get that. You will end up losing it. Have you seen my crafting level, by the way? Sorry, not my crafting level, my smithing level. I did, I did. Yep. Very, uh, very sexual, I must say. Very nice, very nice. My mining is now 76. Archaeology is 74. <laughs> Wait, your mining is what? 76. Bitch. Can I tell you what I did? Cheated, that's what. And you're going to tell me off for this. I, um... So one of the uh, events that came up over the weekend was Celebration Lamps. Which is the thing you told me about, which is the 100% uh, experience in one, 5% in every single other. Uh. Yep. I kind of went a bit mad with that, basically. How much? How uh, about 100 keys. Oh! <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> in my defense... Nah, there isn't really a defense you can come up with in, for this one, I'm in, afraid. In my defense... <laughs> you, are, you are now a pay-to-win player? In my defense, I had fun. Well, I mean. <laughs> and I am in the mood for a pigs and blanket sandwich from Asda with some of their chunky chips. Oh, I haven't had a pigs and blanket in ages. Do you know what? I I, I gained a day again this week, chat. I thought it was Thursday today. I was like, oh yeah, Chelsea isn't going to be working tomorrow because it's the day off. I'm not going to be doing uh, an afternoon stream. I'm going to get some bacon and sausage out and we'll do uh, breakfast. And I was like, oh shit, yeah, it's only Friday. I mean, only Wednesday today. God damn it. <laughs> Dude, I'm all over the shop. I mean, I'm just dying at this stage. I've given up trying to figure out what day it is. I just know when I stream and when I don't. I had one the other week. It was divine. Stop describing food as divine. God damn it. It's so weird. Mm, divine is a acceptable no, I don't, explanation don't... of food, but I wouldn't use it for pigs and blankets. And don't get me wrong. I fucking love me some pigs and blankets. But darn, divine, darn nice is what I would, how I describe it. Yeah, divine is like pure S plus plus tier. Yo, chat, can we talk about how my world just started to shimmer? We've done it, boys. Ability to, oh, cool! I can wield dragon long swords and dragon daggers now. Ooh, more treasure kill hunter keys. <laughs> you should also have access to Lost City now. Yes. Oh yeah, you're in the no, you're in the <laughs> yeah. <movie>. Idiot. <laughs> so the next thing I wanted to do is the Heroes Quest. Wait, no, there's Ooh. one more before Heroes Quest, I think. Good old Heroes Quest. I mean, that was probably my favorite quest I've ever done. Heroes. Yeah, it's what I'm working on because I know I've got I've got two more to do before that. Basically, I'm trying to remember. I still need to get legends done. Uh, where's my guide? I had a guide up somewhere. Google, help me. Heroes quest. You know you could just click on the quest and it'll bring up all the uh, I, requirements for it. I have the ones that aren't enabled hidden. Or I can't do hidden. And I'm too lazy to undo that. Uh, Dragon Slayer, which is done. Merlin's Crystal and Druidic Ritual. You should have done Druidic Ritual already. If someone lets you do Fletching. Uh, Herb Law, sorry. Or teaches you how to do it, rather. Okay, let me just do a thing. Um, 
Let me unlazy a second. Can complete. So here is nice quest. to see you. To see you. Nice! Uh, Merlin's crystal is the one I haven't done. Defeat a twenty-three knight, a level twenty-three. That is going to be tough and difficult. A twenty-three knight. How am I going to stand up to that? Talk to King Arthur. I need a bread, a bucket, insect repellent, and bat bones. Well, I know where to get bat bones. No, to get bread. No, to get bucket. Insect repellent. Where's insect repellent? Also, you got enough uh, moolah for a uh, dragon shield. Not a dragon fire shield, a dragon shield. Uh, yeah, but I don't want a dragon shield. Uh, you might want to if you're planning on doing Slayer at any point. Slayer! I mean, I'm not yet, so I'm not worried about it. <laughs> well, perhaps you should sort your life out and start doing Slayer. Well, maybe you should chop. Yeah. You. Yeah, how about that? Shop. Haven't told anyone to shop in ages. Oh. Oh, boomer. You're a boomer. You're a boomer. Ah, I can't click the bat to hit it. Hashtag smack that bat. Just don't fucking eat it. Eat it. Just eat it. No, don't eat it. No one wants to eat it. Eat it. Uh, right, so we got bat bones. Bread is next. Got a bouquet. Insect repellent. If I keep saying it, it might appear in my inventory. Insect repellent? Don't you yell about bananas to me, you bitch. Bananas from wherever the hell you're talking about. I've got like seven buckets. Sorry, let me pronounce that correctly, chat. I apologize. Bucket. And no, that's not the new egg. Bucket has passed. Um, egg no, I said no, damn it. Now, where's my bread? I have no bread. Okay, I'm going to be lazy and buy that from the Grand Exchange. For 50% mark. Insect repellent? <laughs> Insect repellent. Oh, no. Tomo, thank you very much. Uh, you have now prompted a uh, thing. Tell a joke and laugh track. Chat, I ordered something yesterday. Just for that very prompt. <laughs> nice. <sighs> right, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> What's the difference between a soldier and a policeman? You can dip a policeman in your... Bo oh, wait, you can't dip a policeman in your boiled egg. <laughs> Oh, my investments on dumb shit will never cease to amaze me. Hi, Charles. Um, Shiv wanted ring fit reps. Hang on. Seven, eight, nine. Can you hear the beeping? Yeah, I was going to say, what is that? It's counting it on ring fit. Yeah, so good. Hi, Charles. How are you? I'm good. Are you okay? I'm good. I've got a deal to make of you. Oh. Um, I present to you, um, can you make dinner, and I will mow the lawn after the stream. Is it stream later? Ah, yes. the negotiator. But I've got two hours to get stuff done, but I don't really want to do mowing the lawn and doing uh, dinner at the same time. I mean, I was ready to do that. I haven't got Chinese. I do have Chinese. <gasps> Never mind. I've got I've got Chinese. Can I come all that up for you? Nah, that's like five minutes of microwave dude. That's fine. I was thinking about like half an hour of cooking and stuff like that. Okay. No, that's cool. Thank you very much. <sighs> no, so, I uh, do got Chinese. Uh, lawn. <laughs> yeah, can you mow the lawn? <laughs> what do you mean you can't? Hey, hang on, hang on. Let's have a conversation. What do you mean you can't mow the lawn? I've never tried. It's like vacuuming on grass. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> Chip says I'm not wrong. <laughs> um, okay. I mean, he's had like a, a nasty poop again. I, he got it really bad on his feet. You know? I had to wash him down and he clawed the shit out of me again. Um, but it, he's been alright actually most of the day. It's been way better than it has been the last couple of days. So I think it is working. <laughs> Vacuuming on grass, amazing. Literally, it's all it is. He's very chill today. I don't know what's going on with him today. I've, I've taken him off me like twice and he's been absolutely fine with it. Why are you so chill today? Wow. 
Okay, Jack, before I read that out loud for Chelsea to hear, what the hell does that even mean? Uh? I... I that doesn't make any fucking sense. It doesn't, does it? Oh, he's going about the poo-poo. Yeah. Right, okay. Jack saying the poop, the cat poop, it's more Nutella than a Snickers, sure. Is he just... Dude, he is chill as fuck. Look at him. There you go, chat. Free cat cam for you. Um, insect repellent. What did he say, Bubba? Sorry? He said the poop was more uh, Nutella than Snickers. Which is a gross analogy, but it is not far off either. What had a literal sweet corn in it? I went to the shop the other day and I saw dog poop was literal sweet corn. Are you sure it's dog poop? Because they shouldn't be eating sweet corn. Um, I mean, I'm hoping it was dog poop. I think you may have seen the human turd. Well, yeah, I saw the sweet corn, actually. Um, hmm, okay. Dogs can eat sweet corn. It's awesome. an ingredient in a lot of homemade meal balanced with a good source of protein. Avoid the cob. If your dog bites a piece of the corn on the cob and causes intestinal blockage, leads to serious digestive issues. I thought sweet corn was one of those things they couldn't have because it's also not that great for humans either in large amounts. No, they can have it. Nothing's great for anything in large amounts. I disagree. Everything in moderation, including moderation. You can eat all the dust you like. It's got zero calories. If you eat a lough, though, it'll probably give you like severe like I don't intestinal think... blockages. Okay, that uncounting i don't think you could eat enough of it to ever have like i think you'd be in a constant calorific deficit trying to eat dust you'd be spending far more energy than you would can, well yeah must be spending far more calories than it would kill you before you <sighs> start to death i think well, it's a hard yes you technically would be eating a human you'd be eating like human I mean, seasoning not that much. there's not that much skin cells in dust is there uh, it's what dust mostly is, isn't it? Skin cells and hair uh, and shit. Google. <laughs> already Googling. Google. Um, no, I'm okay. Oh, yeah, I'm wrong. You're wrong? Specific percentage of dust is said to be skin, usually around 70 or 80%. Unless you're a molting bird or reptile. Uh, I'm neither of those. Which, that's murder. He's a molting bird or reptile. I knew there was a lot of skin in dust, but I didn't realize it was that high. Dust. Yeah, it's mostly skin. You should hang out around here, though. It's mostly cat hair. Duft. Yeah, that's human skin cells, Charles. Yeah. Charles, how many consoles do you reckon you have to clear out before you clear out a whole human out of a PlayStation? Do you reckon two? <laughs> that bad. I'm pretty sure my PCs have like at least three of me in inside it before. I think uh, Chelsea needs to sit down with Murdo and explain how to clean out a PS3. Oh, yeah, you need to have a conversation with Murdo at some point because his PS3 is actually going to take off Murdo's. He's got a PS3 and oh my god. We don't fix PS3s, so I don't know how to fix them. Oh, okay. You should just tell him anyway because it'd be really funny to tell him the wrong thing. Just pour bleach <laughs> in it. Apparently, they're like really confusing to fix, but I've not seen the part of Pour bleach into your PlayStation, it'll soon clear out the dust. Pretty sure they had really bad heat sink issues, so like they were just loud AF anyway. I don't think like necessarily it's bad, more like it might be too good, if that makes sense. Because like they like the fans really speed up to hit, kick that heat out, and they're doing a great job. Clearly, it's working, but oh my god, it's so loud! Please stop! Ow, 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 my ears. Right, guys. Uh, I think it's more an inefficiency with the heat sink. Yeah, probably. But it doesn't dissipate because uh, I think it was the fans when they were milled because they're alley, uh, alley heat sinks. They weren't milled thin enough, so they retain too much heat. They don't mm. dissipate it quick enough. Okay. Now, chat, I don't want to jinx it or anything, but unless I've just like really stopped noticing at all, have I sniffed it all today? Uh, to be fair, it's got to the point you do it so much I've kind of tuned it out, but I don't think you have. Yeah, I know I did it a second ago, Charles. I was, I was aware of that, but that's why I asked. I don't think I've done it much today at all. You normally make a point of apologizing when you do. Yeah, if I do, like, too much. This is... Hey, maybe my issues are starting to clear up a little bit. So, yeah, I haven't really talked about that at all. Um, the doctor basically said... Or the nurse, sorry, that called me back. The doctor never gave me any advice, basically. She said, oh, if it doesn't clear up by itself in a couple of weeks, let us know. Um, 
I actually spoke to somebody um, who's a regular on the stream on Instagram about this. Like, on the, it's the 24th of March the message was from. I was like, oh yeah, I've got this shit going on. And it had already been going on for a while even then. So it's been going on well over a month at this stage. Anyway, the nurse called me back. Uh, basically, what I've got to do is like do a, a like a saline salt spray up my nose. And then she said that. Ooh. I ended up getting the wrong thing, I think. Um, but it seems to be working. It's like an obus oil yeah. kind of thing. Well, you've got like a general it's nasal a, it's spray. It's a decongestion. Decongestant, which is like, mm -hmm. pretty, you know, will help with the issues regardless. Is stuff that like fucking hurts? Uh, it doesn't really hurt. I've done it wrong a couple of times and it's just been like liquid in my nose rather than actually going into where it needs to go. Nice. That was kind of gross. And then you have to, the problem is I do, I've done it twice now where I got one right and one wrong. So I've gone to like sniff it up and the one that's done right has gone way further than I think it's supposed to and it feels really weird. So yeah, that's great fun. Um, but yeah, other than that, everything seems to be relatively okay now. I mean, I've taken two antihistamines in the last two days. Which may help as well, because she was like, possibly, you know, hay fever um, doesn't always come in like runny nose, stuff like that. It could literally be this is the only thing that you're getting from hay fever and stuff like that. So, mm. and then the other thing is starting to chew gum, because again, the motion of yeah. chewing and stuff. So, I ended up getting these chat, because I hate mint. Um, I also hate bubblegum as well, but they do have bubblegum flavoring in, which is disgusting. I but, find the sorry. Starburst ones lo like. They're way too intense when you first start chewing them. Yeah. And then they lose their flavor really quick. You're not wrong. I have noticed that a lot. But in all fairness, all I'm doing is chewing. So I don't really give a shit. I'm not that bothered about the flavor. It's more a case of I just don't want mint. It's medicinal. But yeah. Medicinal Starburst chewing gum. It's beautiful. What am I doing? I'm just standing here looking dumb. Random tangent. Looking kind of dumb. Yeah. Uh, so the phone I got on Sunday. Uh. You what? Sorry. Sorry. My phone I got on Sunday. Your phone on Sunday, yep. Yeah. Let's take a minute to say that my battery is on 37% and I haven't charged it since I got it. And I got it on 80%. Dude, that is... Uh... And that's heavy usage as well. That thing's going. That thing is fucking beast. Little bit slow when you compare it to like a £1,000 like top tier... Uh... I can't remember the call them now. The main one. Flagship phone. Yeah. Ah, uh, sorry, there's two people talking at the same time then. I completely lost the end of your conversation, Jeff. Two seconds. No, it's shit. It's rubbish. Okay. And I've already managed to break it as well. Okay. Um, Help. It looks like a thing, so I, that's great. Not like, what, honestly? Sorry, Jeff. I didn't mean to. I was, there was two voices going at the same time then. What do you mean you can't? What? Jeff? Hello? You okay? Yeah, no, I had Chelsea talking still, so I didn't. No, she's talking to the cat now, who's now attached itself to the laces right. of her thing. And now she's he's monkeying away up, up Charles. A bit more. Adventure cat. There you go. He's just, like, attached to my side. <laughs> Come on. You'll play with anything that isn't yours, won't you? <laughs> Don't you meow at me. You're a pain in the bum. Aren't you? What have you done to my arms today? What you've done? That's you. Go and play. Go grab mom. You see, I see a butt there. Go get it. Don't run. Wine gums could be good for chewing. Dude, I honestly did think about getting some wine gums. I really like wine gums. The slight advantage that I have with this Starburst crap is like it's sugar free. Whereas wine gums encouraging me to like eat more sugar stuff, and I'm already on like two of these a day. So the l the less sugar I can get into my system, the better. At this stage, you also don't want like medicinal wine, obviously. Medicinal wine. Yeah, wine gums. Like you don't want to be having too much wine. I'm gonna throw you a listen. Uh, I'm gonna throw a no you. Uh, I'm gonna throw a no you too. Ah, uh, smart. I want to become, do I want to become a knight of the round table chat? Is that what I want to do? No. Heroes, no. Merlin's crystal. Is that a, is that what I want to do? Yeah, we'll ask him. Yeah, it is. Hello, I want to become a knight of the round table. Yeah, it turns out, yeah, that's exactly what I need to do. Uh, well, in that case, I think you need, to, hang on, let me do a King Arthur voice. <clears throat> well, in that case, I think you need to go on a quest to prove yourself worthy. 
My knights all appreciate a good quest. Unfortunately, our current quest is to rescue Merlin. Back in England, he got himself trapped in some sort of magical crystal. We've moved him from the cave we found him in, and now he's upstairs in his tower. I'll, I will see what I can do then. Talk to my knights if you need any help. Help! How do I... Idiot guy stuck. How do I help? Oh, uh, really? So I've just spent this whole time crafting in maple shield bows. Yeah. To realize that the yak track's over. Oh, yeah, it's been done since Monday. Uh, 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 perhaps the mighty Excalibur would be powerful enough. The Lady of the Lake. Oh, I know where she is. I know exactly where she is. Let me go now. Hello. Yeah, she's in the lake. Uh, Crystal, Merlin's trapped in. Sorry, I can't help you with that. Okay, you're fucking useless. Thanks for no help at all. Well, on the plus side, I made, made nearly a mill making those bows. That's not bad. I'll stop myself. Uh, two, tried everything. 2,500? Okay. 2,500. I'm on a human. Are you? Yes! Are you sure? Yes! I would debate. I, you know, I'll debate all over your face in a minute. Oh, uh, we're going to have to have a mass debate. Uh, master debate. Good no, morrow, no. sire. <laughs> what a dick. Rude. I mean, I, I've spoken to... Oh, hang on. I haven't spoken to you. No, you're, you're cracking open a safe. I should probably not go anywhere near what you're doing. So I spoke to all the dicks down here. Is there more dicks upstairs? There I is mean, more dicks upstairs. Sir Tristram. Hail Arthur, King of the Britons. Um, hello? Do you know much about breaking magical crystals? Funnily enough, absolutely nothing. Great! Perfect! Thanks for wasting my goddamn time, you knightly bitch! I mean, you strong. tin can useless piece of turd! Hello, Sir Pallas. Are, are you okay? No. Greetings to the court. Uh, best guess, some sort of magic. Unfortunately, Merlin was a magical expert. <sighs> You say Murdo's our magical expert. Murdo's our magical expert. How can I help you, sir? Belvedere. Merlin's in a crystal. Little help. That's what we're hoping from you, adventurer. Okay, thanks. Anyway, Lancelot. You're a penis. Tell me what to do. Greetings. I'm Sir Lancelot. Touch my dick. You are... You need to calm down, son. Knight of the round table. Comment I can't... Uh, okay, I mean, I've asked every bloody body and they're all like... Like, like what? Really disgusting. Noise. They're all sucking on their own turds. I mean, perhaps that's how they like it. Well, this is not helpful. Shiv, make them helpful. Oi. Fucking be helpful. That, I like to chew on plastic. That's incredibly tame for you, Chuck. <laughs> Uh, Jack is sucking, am I right, chat? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> we have fun here. Um, okay, so I don't know who to talk to, so I'm just going to go look at a quest guide instead. I'm the nice guy. Duh. I made a, I made a mistake. Yeah. I started listening to Avicii because I was like, yeah, I want to listen to some EDM. Get back in the mood. And it's now made me sad. Oh. Oh, right, yeah, because he's... Yeah, okay. Not that he's dead. Like, I don't know the guy. He literally has zero impact on me, but, like... He won't make any more cool music. Okay, so I've got to talk to Sir Gawain. That's not funny, chat. That's literally his name. Don't laugh. I think it's actually Gawain. No, it's Gawain. Yeah. Pretty sure it's Gawain. Pretty sure it's Gawain. Sir Gawain, there he is. Hello, Gawain. He's got granite gear. Oh, I didn't go for the third option. Yoki doki loki. Oh, bollocks. I fucking activated Photoshop. Stop making me depressed. I haven't done the coitus in about a year. He's 17. That should be an issue. Now, if you get to 45, that's probably an issue. But even then, it's not an issue. Sex is merely a state of mind. Otherwise, how would you be able to jizz in your sleep? 
Game thinks it's blah, 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 blah. I mean, Such no one here is married, so no one's had coitus in their entire lives. So yeah, we're, we're all that? Christians here. Hello, Sylvanas. I mean, sex. Is yeah, for she doesn't know how to without... making kids. Yeah. That's it. I mean, I use uh, clone technology, but see, Yester doesn't even doesn't even make the the, the jiggy jiggy. I've never even I've been, never done it in my life. Don't know what don't know even what you're talking about to be honest. I know the song "Getting Jiggy with It" by Will Smith. Is that what you're referring to? Close. Okay. Okay. All right. I am going to try and finish this goddamn Slayer quest. Slayer. While also getting rinsed. <laughs> hey, good luck. I believe in you. Jester hasn't even held hands with a woman. He's that good of a Christian boy. Exactly. I didn't realize he was that good. I'm real good. I'm a real good boy. I am impressed. I, I get that a lot. A lot of people are very impressed by my uh, fortitude. Vir mm. vir virtuality. No. Vir vir vital no. Virtuism. Yeah, virtue. Ooh. That's the word. That was almost a very big mistake. What, virtue? No, I almost went in to fight the uh, Addy Dragons without a dragon fire shield. Wow, that would have been silly. That would have sucked real oh, hard. Oh, that would have been so quick. so dumb. Um, I need to get in from the back, Winky Face. Remember, God doesn't frown upon it in, from the back. Is that is a fact? Uh, it's a jest fact. Nice. And listen, why would I lie to you guys, right? I'm the most Christian here. Don't uh... doesn't the Bible disapprove of your kind? Don't really know. What <laughs> about. Also, what Jester said. Uh... <laughs> I mean, if you depends on how you look into the Bible, it disapproves of everybody. So, what do you mean, my kind? <laughs> um, people who wear mixed fabrics. Okay, I got to talk to some 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 dick nose. Where is he? It's all of our kind. If you wear mixed do. fabrics, you are damned to hell. My kind. I mean, the and Bible... If you do anything that even remotely constitutes The Bible work, says I'm... if two men lay in the bed together, they should be stoned. Uh, no, it doesn't, actually. And it says if man lieth with man like man lieth with woman. Then they should be stoned. And in my experience, it definitely helps. Right, guys? I mean, right? Mm... Right, guys? Right? Right, guys? Haha. <laughs> right, guys? Haha. <laughs> You just stoned off drugs. Chat, would you Could be, be up, would you be upset if I changed it on the wall to Wonderwall, and then actually change the song as well? I'm pretty sure everyone's actually disappointed you haven't done that yet. Yeah, a lot of people are disappointed in a lot of things with me, which is fair because I'm a very disappointing person. Wonderwall? I don't think so, buddy. <laughs> there you go, Sabrina. Thank you very much for joining the wall. Uh, Gibbo's done, so he can go in the bin. Not literally Gibbo in the bin, but... Mr. Shiv on the wall. I think exclamation mark Wonderwall is probably going to have to be the way this channel goes. We've been yeah. making so many improvements to the channel recently. I think that's going to have to be another one. Shiv, there is yours. Oh my god. Can you see? Guys! Uh, see guys! <laughs> god, the light is so awful. Only if the what clip includes someone saying, like anyway, now. here's Wonderwall. I'll do it. Uh, what do you mean? What's the like? It, like it's your lighting isn't bad, but it used to be like you could read it. Well, if I do this, it's just if you do it during the day now, is it literally just outdoor lighting? There you go. Oh, I did a thing. I've got a ring light on. Oh, that. this is gonna end badly. Okay, well, never mind. Guess yeah, I was gonna explain. I'm gonna fucking die. Anyway, oh, no, okay, right. here's Come Wonderwall. Okay. Turbo, thank you very much for joining the wall also. Let me just turn the ring light off so you can see your own name. There you go. Yeah, sorry, what were you saying? I panicked. So, you see, right. I don't think it makes too much difference on the illumination, to be honest. But, like, that's with the ring light on. So you can barely see it unless I angle it. If I turn it off, then there you go. Oh, wow, that makes a massive difference. Yeah. But I don't know how much it affects the lighting in the room now, because I've got that huge-ass light there, so... 
Is it a, uh, is it that Razer camera you got? Yeah, yeah. Nice. How is it? Beautiful. It's like the best camera I've ever had. To the sweat drips down my legs. Have you been walking with me? Uh, Mate, if you don't pass out of sweat when you're doing a walk, you're not walking quick enough. Where do you walk to? Various places, best security reports around. I suppose I can get a lift anywhere. Uh, I like to walk at least Sorry, 10 miles, otherwise it's not really a walk. You know what I'm saying? Candles, which I need to deliver. What? I'm supposed to talk to him and he's not giving me what I need. No, you got to try and get that like, candle. Give me there. what I came for. Or give me nothing at all. Yeah, I'll take your medium plate salvage, mate. I really need to change that. I've still got my thing set as like secondary option, is main option. So when I go to attack anything, I just walk right up to it and let it fucking bitch slap me. Right, I've got to get inside a crate. Crate uh, news, everyone. If memory serves, it's like the southern crate? Got it. Oh. <laughs> I'd like to Was walk 500 southern? miles and then maybe walk 500 more. You better not be doing that right now. What do you mean? Got I've got no reason to get in there. I have. The guy is going to deliver shit to... Burger. That might be more than one crate. Oh, I'll get into his, somebody's crate in a minute. Uh, innuendo? I did mention something about a vegetable stall. But I can only steal from it. I don't want to steal from it. I want to get in a crate. You're a good boy. Let me in. Five hundred oh miles up and down my stairs. How long would that take? Oh, that's interesting. Super defense pots are now noted. Oh, I like that. That makes the looty doot to be easier. That's not helpful. I, I do the can can down the stairs every now and then. I like to run as fast as I can up and down the stairs. Am I the, chat, are you weird like me? Do you use your uh, arms and legs to run upstairs sometimes? No. Like an animal. I do. Uh, I take steps three at a time, though. I like to run upstairs on all fours. Yes. Hell yes, I have Want to race? <laughs> Fucking race. Okay. Ha oh, hang on. There's a search crate. There's a hiding crate. And there's many more searching crates. I'm going to guess it's probably the hiding crate. I'm going to guess so too. Hi, little red. How are you? Oh, a journal. Oh my god. It's oh, no, it just disappeared. Wait, do I need to talk to the candle maker? Yes. Would I be interested in buying some of your candles? No, thank you. You don't want these candles. All right. This bitch will not let me. Hmm. Okay. Didn't really want to... Hmm. I'm confused. Sorry, I'm confusion. Dot com? Walk a few steps west of... And you find some crates for an individual. Click on the large one, slip inside and hide. I... He won't let me slip inside! Daddy? Chat, please don't take that out of context. Why are you not also using skills? Why? <laughs> Oh, is there some key information I didn't get from Lancelot? Oh, piss in my sarnies and call me Billy. This is ridiculous. Uh, I would rather not. Remember Wonga, the company that's been sued to hell and back because of their uh, taking advantage of people with payday loans. Yeah, I remember them. With their stupid puppet adverts. Oh, give me the bones, daddy. That's what you're about to refer to, isn't it? It's the, it's the old people puppets. Do, 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 do. Okay, we've got to talk to Sir Lancel. Again. Because, you know. Did you see how much the... Because uh, obviously, Wonga went to administration and got fucked and everything. Did you see how much the payouts they're giving back are? No. They, so, like, it's... I think it's point one something something percent. Of, like, the money that you borrowed off them, you're getting refunded. Nice. Because there's that many loans. Well worthwhile, then. Yeah, so, like, if you borrow, like, 100 quid, you get, like, I think it's, like, 17 pence or something like that. Also, what kind of sign is do you want me to urinate in Cybrinus' fish finger? I mean, if you're going to have to eat sandwiches that someone's peed in, unless you're into the taste of pee, you're going to want something quite strong flavoured. To hide the taste of the pea. 
So, I'm going to go for Meatball Mar Marinara. Maybe a sharp cheddar. <laughs> Very mature. Okay, so you won't let me do that. So now I go hide in the crate. Big brain, boys. We just have to talk to the right guy a second time. Fucking no. game. I hate this game. <laughs> Amateur move. you got to talk to the people. I don't want to talk to people. People are annoying and they waste my time. Like a, Wen a Wendley Daler. Is it about Wensleydale? Wensleydale is not cheddar. No, it's Wensleydale. <laughs> chat, how do you, do you like fruits and cheese, chat? Fruits and cheese? Fruits in cheese. No, that's just weird. Why would you do that? So you've never enjoyed a stilt and an apricot cheese? Why would I want to eat something that tastes like a dusty book? It doesn't taste like a dusty book. Stilton 100% tastes like dusty book doesn't uh, no, i'm afraid it does streamer you are actually wrong i'm afraid you're wrong uh, i think you'll find that you're actually wrong apricot and cheshire is godlike dude that sounds so good wensdale and cranberry is also another banger i like a nice cheese board with crackers and cheese and grapes they usually have like nice fruity cheeses with that oh this guy stands no chance what do you mean spare my son he will die like the rest I killed him so fast. <laughs> Tell me how to untrap Merlin. Okay, uh, setting him free won't be easy though. You'll need a magic symbol as close to the crystal as you can find. You'll need to drop some bat bones on the magic symbol while holding a lit black candle. Mate, this candle is lit. This will summon a mighty spirit named Frantax. You'll need to bind him with magic words. Then you need the sword Excalibur, which will sp something shield spell. Where can I find Excalibur? Excalibur. <laughs> <laughs> the Lady of the Lake has it. I don't know if she'll give it you, though. She can be rather temperamental. What are the magic words? Ooga booga. You'll find the magic words at the base of one of the Chaos Altars. Which Chaos Altar I cannot remember. You're useless to me! You damn slag. Now I'm going to kill you, son. Strong. It, the game won't let me kill her, kill her, son. This candle is lit, LMAO. I'm not trying to kill him! I'm trying to leave! <laughs> Gosh darn. Uh, right, where am we? Hero's Quest. Merlin's Crystal. I need to summon the spirit, blah, blah, blah. To bind, blah, blah, blah. I need some magic words from a chaos altar. A lit black candle. Candle's lit. Uh, and the holy thought Excalibur from the Lady of the Lake. Chat, if you were a lady, where would you keep your lake? If I remember right, it's here. Pretty sure it's there. I'm very smart, so it's very likely that I'm correct. Between my... No Cyber Arena, please. This is a family-friendly stream. <laughs> In my armpit cleave. What? You get one water? Cleave. Oh! In your armpit cleavage. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Stop. That's a really... Disgusting way of naming that. I dislike I this. How I feel about that. This is uh, mildly upsetting to me. Have you aware how mildly upset I am? Jack, you just ruined Cyberina's dinner. I hope you're happy. She tried so hard for the money and the food, and now you just ruined it for everybody involved. I seek the sword Excalibur. Sc Excalibur. -pa? Uh, I, sorry, I, I have that artifact in my possession. <laughs> she's a, she's a Scottish lady of the lake. It is very valuable. Not an artifact to be given away lightly. I think the sword's probably heavy, right? I'd want to give it away to Ono and Gur. They would prove that. Set a test for me. Port Sarim upstairs. Go upstairs and touch that man's dick. Got it. Okay, I can do that. Fine then, me tits. You keep a, a lake in your late. Okay. Hello, Sylvanas. Have you come to find uh, it's Red's food? Because it's better than yours. And damn right, it's better than yours. Damn right, it's better than yours. I can feed you, but I'll have to charge. Rude. 
Red's food brings all the cats to the yard and they're like, it's better than yours. <laughs> we have fun here, guys. Don't charge your cat. You ever have those times that you really wish the streamer would stop? Please, kind sir, my family and I are starving. Could you... No! Fuck off! <laughs> Get out of here, poor person! I give the bread to the beggar. It's the test! You can't fool me! I knew you were after bread, you whore! I could have given you bread back there! Okay, we've got Excalibob. Do you know Fine. what you have Excalibob? I didn't have Excalibob. I had uh, Everlight. Oh, right. We never have it. Dragon, can you please not? My gerbil is called Sylvanus. God, Cyberine, you're so cool. <laughs> Did I call her Sylvanus or Sylvie? Because, yeah, her full name is Sylvie. Oh! Chair cat, boys! She looks so pissed. There you go. You don't even need to pay for chair, uh, cat cam right now. I can just do this. You can see cat. I want a dog, I'm going to call him Rex, or I'm going to call her Snoozy. Um, okay, let's have a look at the rest of this thing. Batbones, done that easy enough. Okay, so that's Black Candles, easy enough. Magic words, Zamorokian Temple in Varok. Southeastern part of the city near Aubrey's Rune Shop. I can do that. To Varok. V. Or Machine. I like Machine as a dog's name. Why? That's just mean. Or Blade. He's not a vampire hunter. Uh, I prefer Blad. Yeah, Blad sounds way better. Da, I am Blad. Woof. <laughs> 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 Why did that tickle me so much? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why it amazes me sometimes when people just start laughing at the shit I say. <laughs> oh, that proper tickled me. <clears throat> Manly. <clears throat> Oh, you're funny. You're funny, man. Sometimes I am. <laughs> I'm glad I provide the ha-has. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Remember, chat, I get, I give you one ha-ha funny every stream, and that is your ha-ha funny. You're welcome to leave now. It doesn't get better than that. It's also about the same time as well. It takes about three <laughs> hours to, to make anything funny. Uh, right, so I need a bucket of wax. Bucket. Okay. Bucket. Bucket. Silly. Hey, chat, do you want a uh, sneak preview of the shirt I'm going to be wearing for the 24 hour live stream? As long as the sneak preview doesn't show any of the design, it's literally just the sleeve. I mean, I can just, I can just do that. I mean, you don't want to give anything away. I mean, I, I kind of wanted to give a little bit away just to give chat some cool content. But Give it away, give it away now. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. Every time I enter the chat now, hello, I'm here for the ha-has. And then I'll tell you, depending on how far we're away we are from five to four, uh, how far away it is. Like, oh, you have to hold on for uh, about now. Black candles! Hmm, in this candle-making trade, we have a tradition that is very bad luck to make black candles. Very bad luck. I will pay good money for one. I still don't know. Blood. <laughs> I am blood. Da. Oof. Uh, tell you <laughs> what. <laughs> I'll swipe a black candle. <laughs> if you can bring me a bucket full of wax. I can bring you a bucket full of wax. There's a man with bees over here. Sorry, hang on. Not the bees! Bees! Not the bees! I still haven't seen that movie. I need to watch it. It's weird. Da, I am beekeeper. <laughs> Buzz. Nah, that was good. We've already had a funny moment. Sorry, chat. I've ruined it. I've killed it for everybody. Da, I have. Have to do now. Right, where is Beeman? Sir Beeman? Hello? Mr. Beeman? What do I think of your apiary? It's fine. I would like some wax. Okay, he hands me some insect repellent. Okay, so literally, it was just... This guy loves bees. 
He loves bees so damn much. You've never met a man who's more into bees than this man who's into bees. Have you ever heard of a man called Nicolas Cage? I mean, I'm just going by what this guy says. I, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, I need insect repellent on this. Call the time of death. 1925. One day I will die, chat. Confirmed. And uh, someone will go back to the stream and go, he was right. He literally died at the 25, 25 past seven. What happened? Um, I, I hope I'm there in the moment you die. Are we doing it together? Because like, I don't want to be there for, like, compassion. Like, I want to be there to hold your hand. I want to hold your hand. <laughs> mm. Shiv, you'll be the cause of death. <gasps> She was like, shit, it's 1920. I'm not going to make it in time. How the fuck did you catch me? Stop yelling about pineapples. God damn it. What's this dick's obsession? Wow. By you Calvin Klein. There's level 68 taking on greater demons down here. Yeah. He about to get fucked, boy. <laughs> oh, I'm sure he's going to do very powerfully. Oh, no, he's getting wrecked. <laughs> okay, I lit the oh, candle. Run, run, but oh, he got fucked. Can we get some Fs in chat he... for Shiv's random friend? Why was he even down here? Madman! I need to summon the spirit and a magic symbol is... Okay, right, I need to find a magic symbol. 